One thing I'm seeing again and again from the UK and US governments particularly is the lack of motivation to do more than they are doing. Yes, they're supplying defensive weaponry to Ukraine to enable them to blow up tanks and cause problems for Putin and his troops and also the supplies and there's many, many, many volunteers all over the place gathering food and medical equipment, blankets and all the usual humanitarian type things and getting it over there. Now, militarily, we don't want to directly intervene because we know where that will lead and we've discussed it on this channel many times. That's the official line from governments. And I read just this morning that despite the video I put out yesterday with Poland offering to surrender all of its mix to America in order for them to be to supplied to the Ukraine, it's been poo-pooed apparently by America for fear of reprisals and getting dragged in. And as I heard on another podcast, Americans are tired of war. And we're all tired of war to be quite frank. Well, some things happened with this country as well, which has uh, given the MOD a bit of a rattle. And to be honest, I'm not sure about this. How do everyone? Welcome back to the channel for a Wednesday. Hope you're doing all right. I'm not too bad. Indoors today, I've actually got the day off, which is uh, quite something. I can catch up with a bit of content for all of you guys. See them two on the wall behind me there? They're my kids. The eldest, he's 18. And God, he's headstrong and all the rest of it and makes his own decisions. And so everybody should do. Now, over Ukraine way, they've set up a, I think you could call it an international foreign legion, encouraging everybody to come and fight on behalf of the Ukrainians. And I'm led to believe that a lot of X-Forces personnel have gone over there and volunteered their services in one form or another. Very brave of them to do so. But what happens when regular serving army soldiers actually decide to? From what I read, four serving UK personnel, including a 19-year-old Queen's Guardman, have gone AWOL, absent without leave and decided to head for Ukraine. And the 19 year old in particular was last heard of on the Polish border about to cross over. And I assume they're all going to volunteer their services for what's going on over there. Now the MOD has been sent into complete apoplexy because there's one thing that Putin made abundantly clear at the beginning of this thing, anybody interferes, you're fucked. Now at the time I thought it was a bluff, but the, the more desperate this man becomes, it's apparent that this invasion of his is uh, turning into a bit of a quagmire, particularly with cold winter conditions setting in. Would he see any excuse as an excuse to retaliate, lash out? And it's certainly a worry if any active serving current military personnel get captured by the Russians. What are they going to think and what's the excuse going to be? Let me know what you think. Uh, I'm just not sure about this. I'm really not. And uh, people like my 18-year-old kid on the wall back there, there could be more of them that think of doing the same, particularly if they're in the army already. Well, it's uh, a very worrying development, really. Anyway, let me know. Toodaloo.